year so this is very special that we get to get together this year and listen to the kids and listen to the story of Jesus so we thank we're just thankful to be here for that I got a few announcements um, Christmas Eve service there will be two services one at 3 30 and then one at 6 o'clock and the ma masks will be mandatory that night so if you're coming to the service just remember that you have to wear a mask that night the annual meeting will be on January 30th at 10.30. Um, and then the offering envelopes are on your way as you leave through the church. Um, you can pick those up for next year. And then um, if you have offering today, there will be plates as you come in that you can put your offering in that. We don't pass the plate during the full day. All right, so let's now bow our heads and join in prayer and prepare for the worship. Dear Heavenly Father, we're so thankful that we get to gather here today to hear the story of the birth of Jesus. Help us to remember that you are the reason for this season. 
We want to thank you for the teachers, the coordinators, and all the musicians for putting this program together today for us. So let us prepare our hearts for worship. Let us join together now in the lighting of the Advent candle. The grace of our Lord Jesus Christ, the love of God, and the communion of the Holy Spirit be with you now and forever. Amen. Let us pray. Stir up your power, Lord Christ, and come. With your abundant grace and might, free us from the sin that binds us, that we may receive you with joy and serve you always. For you are the living and great Father and the Holy Spirit, one God.
long time ago in a village far, far away. A baby was born. But this baby was special. Children, can you help me tell the story? <coughs> Jesus was born in Bethlehem of Judah over 2,000 years ago. That is long before you were born. We will tell the story. We will tell you Jesus' story. Christmas, dear children, is not about trees and lights and presents. Christmas is all about a baby, all about a boy, all about God's love. The book of Isaiah, chapter 9, verse 6 says, For unto, a, for unto us a, chil a child is born, the government will be on his shoulders, and he will be called Wonderful Counselor, Mighty God, Everlasting Father, Prince of Peace. Here's how it happened. Let's show everyone what Christmas looked like. Once there was a girl. Her name was Mary. Mary was very young and a little bit shy. One day, an angel visited her. It was a scary, wonderful day. Mary, you will have a baby boy, and it will be a miracle. Whatever God wants, I will do it. Joseph loved Mary. Mary loved Joseph. They were planning their, their wedding. Joseph was puzzled by God's plan. An angel? A baby boy? It seemed weird to him. He didn't believe it. Gabriel showed up in Jesus' dream one night and said, It's going to be, it is going to be fine, Joseph. Keep playing that way. Whatever God wants, I will do. Mary and Joseph had to travel to Bethlehem to sign their name for the government. The trip was long. Everyone was going to their hometowns. It was crowded on the, on the dusty roads. Mary's baby from God was going to be born soon. I kept knocking on doors asking for a place for Mary to have a baby. Everybody kept saying, no room, sorry, go someplace else.
the Bethlehem hillside were shepherds. The stars were shining. We were watching the sheep. Suddenly, an angel showed up. God's very own angel. <coughs> Don't be afraid. I have wonderful news for you and all the people all over the world. A Savior just has been born in the city of David, that's Bethlehem. The Savior who is the Messiah, is the Messiah and the Lord, baby, the baby wrapped in a blanket, laying in a manger. Then a bunch of angels showed up. They were all over the place. They were singing God's praises. <clears throat> the shepherds were so excited. They told Mary and Joseph what the angels said. Mary just smiled. She kept all these wonderful things in her heart until another day. This was no ordinary night. Angels showed up to announce the birth of Jesus. This was God's night. us so much that he sent his only son from heaven to save us all from our sins until this very day. And God knows everybody loves a baby. So Jesus came to us as a baby boy and the angels sang.
should have been the end of our happy story. But somewhere out but somewhere out east, someplace in the world, there were the wee little kings. And a star, a big star, and presents, there were definitely presents. Gold, bright and shiny. Frankincense, pricey perfume, and myrrh. The wise men looked up and saw a star. It seemed to them that the star twinkled a special, mes special message. They followed that star. The wise men ventured into Jerusalem, where evil King Harold said with a sly smile, I want to worship the newborn king, find the baby, and come back, and tell me so I can go worship him too. The wise men said, we will let you know, and they never showed up at the palace again. Jesus lived on earth. But for this not so ordinary night, Jesus was born. The angels sang, the shepherds showed up, the star shined behind Bethlehem manger. The wee little kings traveled all the way from the east to meet God's gift. The King of Kings, the Savior of the world, 
the Lord of Lords. So let's hear it for our Sunday School program. Thank everyone for coming to this year's Sunday School Christmas program. Um, we learned a few weeks ago in church that, in our children's message, that each and every one of us is, can go out and share God's love. So this was the way our children share God's love with each of you by telling you of Jesus' story of his birth. And to remind each of you how much God loves every single one of you. We have one more thing that we need the children to help us with. And so we're just getting set up here. You guys can all sit down in your chair and don't get posted. And so we have one more song that the children are going to help us with some special effects. And so they're going to assist us. So please enjoy. Everyone sit down. All right. So. So please enjoy uh, this, this song, the East Christmas Light by Denise Camperin, Troy Stevenson, Ward and Mandy Malik, and Special Effects by the St. John Sunday School.
behalf of St. John's, we want to thank everybody who's been involved with the Christmas program and our Sunday school program. It has been a little bit of a challenging year, but as you can see, everybody's doing such an amazing job. So when I read your name, I would ask you to please come up. Your Amber Hedke. Oh, 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 sorry. Amy Bazell. Brian. I'm going to stay up here. Brian Sawal. Harry Failing. Denise Cameron. Dixie Merricky. George and Christy Crum. Heather Krieger. Jaren Failing. Jocelyn Hoppy, Carly Failing, Kate Kellogg, Kira Merricky, Linda Milkey, Macy Merricky, Melissa Filer, Morgan Schwartz, Stephanie Dewhurst, Tom Cameron, and Briley Dent. Thank you everybody so much for all the time and effort that you have put in for this amazing Christmas program and for teaching Sunday school and being here all the time for our, our kids and everybody. So can we show them with a round of applause please? season and growing closer to you. You are just the light of the world and to know you and to go closer to you, we are just so blessed and we are so thankful to be able to gather here today and watch our children and just enjoy it and watch the smiles and the joy in their faces. We just thank you for allowing us to gather here together. And now let us join together in your prayer that you taught us. Our Father, who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done, on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread, and forgive us our trespasses, as we forgive those who trespass against us. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. For thine is the kingdom, and the power, and the glory, forever and ever. Amen. Receive the benediction. As we go on our way, may God go with us. May he go before us to show us the way, behind us to encourage us, above us to watch over us, beside us to befriend us, and within us to give us peace. Amen. Go in peace. Christ is near. Thanks be to God. And all of God's people said, Amen. Have a great week. All right, don't go anywhere. We do have Christmas bags for the children, whether they're in our program or just a guest today. And there is going to be also some coffee, cookies, and lemonade if you give us one minute to open all the doors. <laughs>